Hey guys, I'm Cory, and welcome to your very first Thursday here on Time of Gay. So the theme for this week is basically just to get to know a little bit more about each of us here on the channel. So I'm going to start off this video by telling you guys a little bit about me. I have brown hair and brown eyes. I live in Canada, Ontario, um, a little town close to Toronto. I went to school for photography and I don't know what else to say. <laughs> I hate when you hang your clothes up and you get these friggin' pointy things on your shoulders. Annoying. Let's just learn a little bit more about me through the questions that the guys have asked this week. So question one comes from Bo. He asked, if you could be any animal in the world, what animal would you be and why? Now I haven't put too much thought to this question. I think it would have to be a dog, maybe? A dog that has like a loving home? like loving owners to treat it properly. But if we're talking about look wise, I mean, I'm obviously a duck. Meh. The next question comes from Ross and he asks, what is your favorite time of day? My favorite time of day is morning just because I feel like when you wake up early in the morning, you feel like you have the whole day to look forward to. Even though I don't necessarily wake up really early every morning, I wish I was a morning person. I wish I could wake up early, but uh, I'm just one of those lazy people that likes to sleep in all day. Except for I have been getting up around like 9, 30, 10 o'clock, which isn't that bad. And lately, lately I've been getting up at like 8, 30, eight o'clock. So if I could just like pat myself on the back right now, like I think I deserve a good, a nice pat on the back. Since you guys can't pat me on the back, you guys can just thumbs up the video. Thanks. The third question comes from Kellison and he asks, who is your favorite Disney prince? And when I first saw this question, up until Bo made his video on Monday, I thought the question was, who is your favorite Disney princess? Obviously I can't read or, or spell or talk apparently. I think all the Disney princes are pretty boring. Like the princes, if we're talking Disney characters in general, I don't know if you can classify Tarzan as a prince. I'm just saying if I saw Tarzan as a real life man, I mean, I'm sure we can all just use our imaginations for a couple seconds and um, I'm sure we all would like to swing on a vine with that young man. So my question, the fourth question, was what is your favorite TV show, past, present, and of all time? And I asked all three, I know my question's like the biggest question. When I was thinking of it personally, I couldn't think of just one. I know that when I was younger, I loved all these TV shows and then now I'm loving certain TV shows, but I wouldn't classify any of those shows as my favorite of all time show. So I was like, why not make it a three-parter, obviously. So my favorite show when I was a chid, a chid, <laughs> a chid. So my favorite show when I was a kid was <laughs> I can't even choose. It was like between Pokemon, Sailor Moon, Sailor Moon was a big one, and Rugrats was huge too. See? See why it's so hard for me to ask questions? Because I can't, I'm so indecisive. My favorite show presently, I got one for this one, shocker, is Pretty Little Liars. It's not believable at all, but it's well written. The acting isn't necessarily the best, but the music and I just like it. Don't ask me why. I'm not, I don't need to explain myself. And my favorite show of all time, <laughs> there's two, Buffy the Vampire Slayer because Buffy's just awesome and who doesn't love Buffy the Vampire Slayer? And What I Like About You with Amanda Bynes. That show I can watch over and over and over and never get sick of. Amanda Bynes is so funny and all the people on that show are just hilarious and it makes me laugh and I'll never get sick of that show. Now the last question comes from Timmy and he asked if you could eat anything one, wait, what? If you could eat one meal for the rest of your life, what would it be? Again, I'm indecisive and I can't think of just one. So I'm going to say it's a tie between McDonald's. I know, I know, I know it's horrible for you, but I mean, we can't deny that it's just freaking delicious, okay? You can't deny it. Don't try to deny it. Just, just shut your mouth. And sushi, okay? Sushi is a more healthier alternative, although it's it's really high in sodium because I, I take my sushi roll and I literally drown it in the soy sauce and then I eat it. Neither one of them are really that healthy, but I mean, if we're going healthy, it's the sushi. If we're going just buck wild, I'm gonna get McDonald's because those are my two favorites and I can live off those babies for the rest of my life. I don't know if I'd get sick of them, but I hope I wouldn't. I don't think I would. I don't know. Anyways, those are all the questions. I just want to say quickly, thank you to Bo for choosing us all and bringing us all together. I'm having fun getting to know all you guys and it's so exciting to look forward to it and it's nice to have a bunch of people that are as excited as I am to be working on this project. So yes, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and um, enjoy watching our videos because I think we're pretty funny and we're pretty entertaining and we're pretty cool people. Hope you like the video. See you next week. Bye guys.